Okay, good morning everybody. Today we are going to do a combination of two beehives. In fact, what we're going to do is a combination of one beehive that is exceptionally weak, that's this one. This beehive currently is queenless and it is not strong enough to survive the winter. And since it's today is the first day of October, there's simply not enough time to requeen and build this colony up to survive the winter because I need enough bees and enough stores for it to survive. So what I'm going to do is what's called a newspaper combination. I'm going to take one of my nukes because I keep several nukes available simply for resources. And I'm going to sacrifice one of the nukes this year to combine it with this beehive so we're going to have enough bees and enough stores to get through the winter. So the adage is take your losses in the fall and that simply means I'm, I'm going to lose one of my actual colonies but I'm going to have the same amount of bees but a stronger group to take care of over the winter. So since I'm using a nuke, I've got a double deep nuke I'm going to pull here, I need to add another box. And since the strongest of the two colonies is the nuke, I want to put the stronger of the colonies on the bottom. And so I've prepped this box here with some of my ant cant. And I'm just going to get it ready to go so that the ants don't get in. Now when you're using a nuke to combine, there's a couple ways to do it. If you only have a single deep or a single nuke, then you'll basically have to use what's called a nuke introduction board, which is a piece of wood with a hole cut out in it. You can either buy them or you can make them. It's not very hard, but the concept is still gonna be the same. So what I'm gonna do right now is pull off this box because I'm gonna put this one on the top. This is the weaker colony. It's currently queenless. There's just not enough bees in it. And I'm gonna move the frames from my nuke into the new box. So that's what we're gonna do. We'll do it now. Okay, what I have here is my screen bottom board. And I've got this little trap which I made for the beetles. I'm just gonna take a little peek. I don't see nothing, but there's a bunch of junk in there, so something's happening. All right. Now I'm going to get my nuke, because it's October and these bees are not happy. Now this nuke is very full, so it's very solid colony of bees. Not necessarily happy, but solid. Since I'm putting them in the bottom, I'm going to go ahead and configure them as I would for the winter. The bees are really upset. They don't like the microphone either. All right, 
right, so as I put these frames in here, I want to keep the brood centered in the middle. And somehow I have a lot of bees in my veil. A lot of bees in my veil, which is going to make this pretty fun. Alright, so all of my honey frames in this particular colony, I want to put to the outside and leave the brood in the center. girls are going to die today. There's a huge difference between spring beekeeping and fall beekeeping when it comes to temperament. So I have to be very careful when I'm moving these bees that I don't drop my queen. Now the bottom box of this nuke is all full of brood, which is great. And I see plenty of eggs, so I know that we're still good. Okay, cool. Alright, so now I've got all ten frames in the bottom. I'm going to squish my frames nice and tight together. Try to get as many bees as I can in the colony. Alright, now, simple trick. One single sheet of newspaper is all I need. And I'm going to put it right over the top. Like so. Now I'm going to take my weak colony. these bees in and I'm going to set them right on the top. Now what I need to make sure is that the bees don't have an upper exit. beetles. So I don't want the, beetle, the bees to be able to get out. So what I'm going to do here is put a simply my outer cover directly on the top. Otherwise, otherwise the bees could get in and out through the notch and we don't want that to happen. So the bees, the only way for the top box to get out is to go through the newspaper. 
the top box doesn't have a queen at all so they'll integrate just fine and in a couple of days they'll already gotten through those the newspaper in a week there will be no newspaper left there at all it'll be completely clean and in front of the beehive i'll see where the bees have torn out and thrown the trash out onto the ground and that's it that's all it takes to do a combination you always want to do a combination if you have a weak hive that you think simply is not going to make it through the winter it's better to have more bees and more food than try to get through the winter with a weaker hive so newspaper combination great fix easy to do <laughs> bees are all over and that's it so if you have any questions about it you can call us at the store we're open uh Tuesday through Sunday, and uh, you can find more at uh, yourbstore.com. That's it.